1994, Audi RS2 Avant. The world's first truly high-performance luxury estate car. In the automotive world, partnerships and collaborations have often led to the creation of remarkable and unexpected vehicles. The Audi RS2 Avant stands as a testament to this notion, born from the fruitful collaboration between Porsche and Audi during a pivotal period for both brands. At the time, Porsche was navigating financial challenges, while Audi was seeking to establish its performance identity. The RS2 Avant emerged as a groundbreaking creation, defying convention and capturing the hearts of automotive enthusiasts worldwide. Dating back to the 1970s, Porsche found itself at a critical crossroads, grappling with internal conflicts and external pressures that threatened the future of the company. Ernst Fuhrmann, a prominent figure within Porsche, held a strong belief that the iconic 911 model had run its course and needed to be retired. Furman's rationale was compelling. The 911 was struggling to keep up with changing market demands. Its sales were declining, and the prospect of complying with increasingly stringent safety and emissions regulations seemed insurmountable for a car that had been around for over a decade. Furman's stance reflected the harsh realities facing Porsche at the time. The automotive landscape was rapidly evolving, with new competitors emerging and customer preferences shifting. It became evident that the 911, despite its storied history and loyal fan base, needed a drastic overhaul to remain relevant and competitive in the market. However, while Furman's arguments had merit, they were met with staunch resistance from other key figures within Porsche, most notably Ferry Porsche. The son of the company's founder, Ferry Porsche believed in the enduring appeal and potential of the 911 and was determined to find a way to revitalize and improve upon this iconic sports car. The internal power struggle and debates about the future direction of Porsche would ultimately shape the destiny of the company. In the face of adversity, Porsche's leadership had to navigate through the complex challenges of innovation, regulations, and customer expectations. The result would be a defining moment for Porsche as it set the stage for the development of a new generation of vehicles that would not only save the company, but also solidify its position as a leading manufacturer of high-performance sports cars. By the end of the 1980s, Porsche still faced significant challenges with a limited and fragmented product lineup. Production costs were rising, while sales volumes remained stagnant. The company was further impacted by the 1987 stock market crisis. Today is Black Monday, the day the Dow dropped more than 500 points. The day the Dow dropped more than 22 percent. Resulting in a sharp decline in 9-11 sales and the looming threat of bankruptcy. With the departure of CEO Peter Schutz, Porsche's financial future seemed uncertain. However, under the leadership of financial director Heinz Bernitzky and subsequent CEO Wendelin Weideking, a thorough restructuring took place. The brand successfully navigated these turbulent times, managing to save the iconic 911 and steer Porsche back towards financial stability. In the early 1990s, Porsche continued to face financial difficulties, partly due to the heavy investments made in developing the Porsche 959 supercar. Both Audi and Porsche were part of the Volkswagen Group, so deciding to uplift each other was a smart decision. Collaborating with Audi on the RS2 allowed Porsche to generate revenue by sharing its expertise and resources, while Audi benefited from Porsche's engineering prowess. Audi recognized the growing demand for high-performance vehicles, especially in the premium segment. By introducing the RS2, Audi aimed to cater to the needs and desires of enthusiasts who desired a powerful and exhilarating driving experience. while still maintaining the practicality and usability of a daily driver. The project began with the Audi 80 Avant as the base model, which would serve as the foundation for the 1994 RS2. Porsche engineers worked closely with Audi to transform the Avant into a true performance machine. The exterior design received sporty enhancements, including a more aggressive front grille, larger air intakes, 
and widened fenders to accommodate wider tires. What truly set the RS2 Avant apart was its handling and dynamics. Porsche's expertise in chassis development was evident, and the RS2 Avant featured a lowered suspension, upgraded brakes, and a meticulously tuned Quattro all-wheel drive system. These enhancements allowed for precise and confident cornering, making the RS2 Avant a true driver's car. Its practicality was further enhanced by a spacious interior, capable of accommodating both passengers and cargo with ease. Beyond its exceptional performance and versatility, the RS2 Avant became a symbol of forbidden fruit for automotive enthusiasts in the United States. Unfortunately, it was never officially sold in North America, making it a rare sight on American roads. However, its impact was felt globally, paving the way for a new era of high-performance wagons and establishing the RS lineage as a hallmark of Audi's performance division. The Audi RS2 Avant not only rejuvenated Porsche's financial standing, but also solidified Audi's position in the realm of performance vehicles. It served as a catalyst for the development of subsequent RS models, which have since become synonymous with breathtaking speed, precision engineering, and everyday practicality. The RS2 Avant's influence can still be felt today, as it inspired other automakers to explore the potential of fast wagons and elevated the expectations for what a high-performance estate car could achieve. Under the hood, the Audi RS2 Avant featured a turbocharged 2.2-liter inline-5 engine, derived from Audi's renowned 20-valve engine. This was a modified version of Audi's 5-cylinder turbocharged engine, known as the ADU unit. Porsche's expertise in forced induction played a significant role in enhancing the engine's performance. The RS2's 2.2-liter turbo engine underwent substantial upgrades, including a new camshaft, larger turbocharger, intercooler, and a custom intake system. These enhancements, combined with a low-pressure exhaust, resulted in an impressive output of 311 horsepower. The unique design of the ADU engine, featuring an offset and canted arrangement, showcased Audi's innovative approach to maximizing power and efficiency. This allowed the RS2 to sprint from 0 to 60 in just over 5 seconds, a remarkable feature for a wagon at the time. The RS2 quickly became known as the first super wagon, combining the versatility of a spacious estate with the thrilling performance typically associated with sports cars. With its impressive performance capabilities, it was able to outpace the renowned McLaren F1 in a sprint to 30 miles per hour, clocking in at a mere 1.5 seconds. The RS2 showcased its acceleration prowess, surpassing the $1 million hypercar by two-tenths of a second. This surprising victory can be attributed in part to the RS2's all-wheel drive system, which effectively distributed power to each wheel based upon grip levels. With its combination of power, agility, and traction, the RS2 proved that it could hold its own even against the most esteemed and exclusive supercars of its time. Today, the Audi RS2 Avant remains highly sought after by collectors and enthusiasts alike. Its limited production numbers and iconic status have elevated its desirability, making it a sought-after classic car. The RS2's legacy as a groundbreaking collaboration between Audi and Porsche continues to resonate, and its influence can be seen in the performance offerings of both brands to this day. The base price of the RS2 was around $65,000. However, it's important to note that prices can vary significantly depending on factors such as the vehicle's condition, mileage, and rarity. Today, due to its collectible status and limited availability, the Audi RS2 can command higher prices in the used car market. Well-preserved examples in good condition can range anywhere from $80,000 to over $100,000, with some exceptional and highly sought-after models fetching even higher prices. As automotive enthusiasts look back on the legacy of the Audi RS2 Avant, they celebrate its pioneering spirit and the enduring impact it has had on the industry. It remains a rare gem, 
sought after by collectors and enthusiasts alike, embodying the perfect balance of power, versatility, and timeless design. The RS2 Avant will forever hold a special place in automotive history, reminding us of the incredible possibilities that can emerge from collaborative ventures and the joy that comes from pushing boundaries and defying expectations.